Members of leadership panel, please allow me to congratulate you on an excellent Internet Governance Forum in Kyoto last year. The Kyoto IGF was a resounding success. It attracted the IGF's highest ever number of the in-person participants and covered the critical topics, including artificial intelligence and its ramifications. Among more than 9,000 attendees, both on-site and online, we also saw the robust and increased participation by governments, parliamentarians, youth, and the private sector. The IGF is indeed a destination for global dialogue addressing critical issues within a digital landscape. You steadfast the advocacy of the IGF and your efforts to increase its reach and visibility have contributed to this success. Well, 2024 is an important year for the IGF. In September, world leaders will come together to adopt the Pact of the Future, including a global digital compact and the regional consultations are also taking place to prepare for the review of the process of the World Summit on the Information Society in 2025. They are concrete measures this estimated panel can take to advance the work of the IGF and bolster the contributions to these uh, important processes. First, I support consideration of the panel in its enabling role to advance the business track alongside the other established tracks. This will fill the gaps in strengthening private sector representation and underscore the IGF's Big Ten approach to global digital dialogue. Second, the panel could leverage the meeting's location in Riyadh a digital hub to attract the much needed participation of startups and young people. And finally, the panel can strengthen the positioning of the IGF as a global platform where the outcomes matter. It is crucial that the IGF's messages and the intersectional outcomes provide meaningful insights and strategic actionable solutions that inform the decision-making at all levels. Dear colleagues, in the years since its inception, discussions at the IGF have evolved beyond the traditional limits of the Internet governance to address the many aspects of the digital age. As we shape the vision of the IGF in 2025 and beyond, it should reflect this reality. I applaud the efforts of the panel in putting forward the principles for an Internet we want. I urge you to champion this framework as the foundation for the future of the IGF. At my department, UNDESA, we are committed to supporting your efforts, your work as you aim for the greater heights for the IGF in this defining year. Thank you.